And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson, and getting ready for a potentially thrilling contest. What might we see today, Stuart? Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And the lineup for the home side. Well, they're playing with two strikers. One will look to stretch the pitch by making forward runs. The other will look to get on the ball and make things happen. But it's still important that they work as a pair. And a glance at the Napoli side. David Ospina begins in goal. Fabian plays alongside Piotr Zielinski in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And they kick off here. Can he finish? And not cleared away properly. And in at the second time of asking. Just what was required. Well, here's the replay, and this is what you're always told as a kid. Go for the far post, make it difficult for the keeper, and then hope your teammate is ready for any rebound. He does exactly that, and they get their reward. What a good goal that was. One nil then. And they need to get tighter. And the referee blows for a foul. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. It might be. Couldn't grab hold of it. And a time for calm on the ball. Sliding in, winning the ball, and what's more, they've kept it. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Zielinski. Well, they couldn't keep possession. And he's beaten him here. Big chance to get them on terms. Well, you have to say, he's going to be very cross with himself. He'll certainly be disappointed with that. That was a poor effort. really be able to trouble them here could be vital intervention now can Napoli use the set piece wisely they take it short 
And he stopped them in their tracks. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. Well, it's Napoli's turn now. And what can they do to stop him running at them? And getting across to stop it. And over comes the corner. Not a bit short with the clearance. Gives it a go. In it goes. That will greatly help the cause. Now they only need to keep concentration levels high. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. Well, a second goal for them here. And they've won the ball back following that challenge. Inching towards the interval, and it's going with home advantage. Stuart, as always, very keen to get your take. Yeah, they're playing really well here. They've controlled the flow of the game. They've won their individual battles, and they've created numerous chances. They're only oh, they could put it away, Stuart. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? Well, look at this again. He's made this look so simple, but I can assure you it's anything but. He just makes a really good, clean connection with the ball and controls it perfectly. A very good goal. Well, the action continues. The push is on with Napoli now. Can they find an equaliser? Well timed tackle. An encouraging move from Napoli. But they dealt with the threat first. Well, as you can see, the hosts have had much less of the ball, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. This attack looks highly promising. Alert defending. Passing high, and they have the ball again. Well, that's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. That is that for the first half here. Well, truth be told, he's only had a very limited influence on this game, Stuart. Yeah, he's just not found his form today. He doesn't look quite right. Unless he can impose himself on this game and start threatening the keeper, they're going to lose this one.
And they kick off here. Well, the action underway once more and the onus is on Napoli to turn this game on its head getting forward and credit is due for that good piece of defending can they get in behind them an effective challenge Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Failed to keep hold of it. Onguisa. Oh, surely! And fine goalkeeping. And they will make the change now. Let's see about the delivery. Goalkeeper's ball, it was always going to be that way. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Must be! Oh, he's found the net! And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. Well, let's take another look. If you lose the ball in those areas, you're going to get punished. And that's exactly what happened there. No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Into the advanced position. Clean challenge. Good thing from his point of view. Oh, he's lost possession. Well, a shot from miles out. And never in any doubt from the keeper. Oh, he's given it away inexplicably. Another goal! And surely there's no way they can throw this away. Absolutely dominant. Well, here it is again, and I don't expect goalkeepers to save everything at their near post, but on this occasion, although it's a good strike, he should do better. Goals and plentiful supply, 4-1 currently. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle, and the referee has got to book him, I think. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. Well, no problems defensively. Tremendously strong in the tackle. 
This might be ideal for the counter. They need to get bodies back. Well, that was easy on the eye, and he didn't miss by much. Well, that's how to counter-attack. They did it with such pace, just couldn't finish it off. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Zielinski. And foul it is then. Well, some referees might have reached for the yellow card, but not this one. Yeah, another foul, and he will get a yellow card, that's for sure. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Just 10 minutes to go. Effective challenge. Zielinski. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Oh, and couldn't convert. So a personnel change then. So almost at full time and the home side very much in command. Stuart, what have you made of their overall performance? Well, what an excellent performance this has been. They've had complete control for most of the game. Their movement, clever passing and energy have been a joy to watch. It's been a really good win for them. And they need to get tighter here. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Zielinski. So the referee blows the whistle, and that will be that for this contest. Not exactly the result Napoli fans wanted to hear. They've lost this game. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, the fans are right to expect more. The tempo of their passing was too slow. They were second to the ball too many times and were beaten by the better side today. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. 